Good day everyone, because today is a good day and also this is a white fox haul. As you can tell from the title, and White Fox, as we all know, is an Australian brand. I'm going to go out there and say it. It's my favourite Australian brand. I absolutely love it. So I thought it'd be rude to not introduce today's video with a classic Australian good day. Was that potentially the most random intro I've ever done for a video? Yes, probably. Yes, it was. I'm just excited today. We all know I love a White Fox haul. We know I love their stuff. So the excitement levels are high today. I feel like Christmas has come early. I feel like Meg from White Fox is my Santa Claus for this year. And I have this app absolutely giant parcel of the most amazing white fox goodies ever that i cannot wait to show you so we're gonna get on with it it's gonna be a try and haul as always everything will be linked down below i do also get excited here i do also have a discount code for you all which will get you 15 percent off i'll leave it on screen here and also down below also if you're in australia new zealand or america you can use afterpay on all your purchases and also get excited uk girlies because express worldwide shipping if you want to put anything on your christmas list you want to get anything for yourself for christmas you want to spend your christmas money on some little goodies you can get express worldwide shipping if you want and you can save 15% off with my code so it's literally a win-win-win and without me blabbering on anymore we are going to get straight on with the video we have track suits we have hoodies we have active wear and we have swimwear because white folks also sell them i have a little bit of everything i literally can't wait to show you we're going to start off my favorite piece okay oh my god we almost pushed the box off the other end of the sofa um we're going to start off with my favorite piece because i literally cannot wait any longer i have eyed this up for the longest time and i'm so glad she's a part of my wardrobe now and it's this little like two piece oh my god we're throwing everything all over the shop today um it's this little hoodie and short set the color of this is this more me have you ever seen anything more georgia clark in your life i don't think you have this is the offstage hoodie in the shade moon and i'm obsessed with this it's gorgeous like beigey slightly almost like greasy color and then it has like a little logo on the front and then on the back boom business in the front part in the back it says white fox volume three is this like the third or fourth hoodie from this collection on white fox i own yes it is do i have any problems with that no i don't i literally love it like i don't know what it is about this bubble font but it literally has me a choke card i'm obsessed with it and then i also got the matching shorts again in the same shade these i got in an extra small and the hoodie i got in a small slash medium these are the offstage lounge shorts and they have a little logo in the bottom here that matches i literally cannot wait to wear this i will be living in this in the foreseeable future if you see me wearing this every single day of my weekly vlogs do not judge me okay i am just obsessed and then like i said i don't know what it is about this bubble font i just love it so i did actually also get another hoodie from the same range this one is in the shade glacier gray it's like this mild gray and then it has this green on it and i have had the matching shorts in my wardrobe for quite a few years now and it was only time that i got the matching hoodie so these are the shorts they're the same as those other ones and then this is the hoodie on the back look at that i just love the green don't know what it is like it's just nice and neutral but then that pop of color i just love it i literally am obsessed with this and these hoodies are my absolute favorite because they fit so well they're so thick they're so cozy if you haven't ever touched a white fox hoodie in your life i feel very sorry for you because they are the nicest hoodies like trust me when i say this we know i'm not really a tracksuit girly but these these are something different these just have like some magical australian effect to them there's something on the other side of the world that just makes these hoodies amazing i don't know what it is but it's there. Then, before I forget me going any further, I did also get this jumper that I'm wearing today. It's like a little quarter zip. It says White Fox, what does it actually say? White Fox Archive 6.0 on the front. It's like a little dark grey on light grey jumper. And then, can you see? It's got it on the back. You'll see it better in the try on clips. I already have another like little quarter zip jumper from White Fox, which I really wanted to wear, but I can't find it. But I've literally had that jumper in my wardrobe for like, I want to say three years and it has washed and worn so well that I decided I needed another one. I just like this because it's a little bit different to just wearing like a hoodie or a sweatshirt, like a crew neck jumper. I just feel like it's a little bit different. Looks a little bit more like fancy. I don't know. I just love it. It's so soft and cozy as well. So I got that before I forget. And now we'll delve into the box. We had to put a few things on the chair in front of me here because they were spilling out. But now we'll go into the box and we have, it's literally like Christmas, like I said, it's like past the parcel. We've got a box inside a box. Look at how stunning this is. Honestly, I felt like Christmas Day had come early when I opened all this. Next up, I got this top, which I think is going to be a new Lizzie McGuire moment. I'm going to be an outfit repeater and wear this all the time. Like, I think this is going to be an absolute staple in my wardrobe. They did this in so many colours, but you know I obviously had to get the white. And it's this, like, kind of, I want to say a vest top. I feel like vest top is really undermining the beauty of this piece. It's just, like, this simple, you know, what would we call this top? Is the tag going to help me out or is she not? She's called taking off top. So like not the most helpful, but it's like a little, it's like a vest top, but it's kind of not. It's just got like 
thick straps and then it's really flattering sort of neckline it ruches around the top and then on the sides of the top on both sides it's got like a little split on it so i just think this so like jeans white tailored trousers literally anything this is going to look so nice it's kind of like a basic vest top but not basic like a basic vest top made fancy do you know what i'm trying to say i really feel like i'm like not doing this justice and i can't explain what i'm trying to explain i'm trying to say it's like a basic vest top that will go over everything but calling it basic is just really undermining her but anyway it's the most lovely material it's so thick like it's so like buttery almost and thick i think this is just gonna be a go-to for me like i'm gonna wear this so much because i love basic things like this but like ones that have a little bit more of a twist to them to make it look a little bit more interesting this is kind of my version of jeans and a nice top and i'm here for it and i need to move on now because i'm absolutely butchering that we're gonna move on to this it's another hoodie but i actually can't wait any longer to not show you this does that make sense to show you this my brain is not braining today i'm just so excited to show you the stuff that apparently the functioning in the brain is just gone look at this can we take a second did i just audibly hear you gasp then i think i did this is stunning this i got in an extra no a large to extra large and it's the comfort club oversized hoodie it's again got that bubble font but it's like a different kind of it's not the exact same because it says white fox comfort club on the front and then look at this on the back i'm obsessed with this color scheme like the marl gray with this pink is absolutely everything i love and i absolutely love pink but i never wear it because i just don't do that do you know what i mean i just don't do it that's not a bit of me but this means i can wear pink without being like pink like barbie and then i also got the matching shorts to go with it of course these i got in an extra small they fit me perfectly and again they're just like the other ones they've just got like the little logo in the bottom so they tie in so nicely with the hoodie wait let me turn her around the right way i don't know why i'm doing this because you're going to see it on in the triangle lips anyway is that or is that not one of the most stunning tracks you've ever seen i think it absolutely is and then talking of pink we have this which is not pink at all at this moment in time it's a lovely brown box but in here we have the most gorgeous pink water bottle i saw this i have about 500 water bottles i'm obsessed with drinkware but i saw this and i was obsessed she needed to be added to the collection look at this i literally love this this is such a nice size i'm pretty sure yeah it's one liter and it says it keeps your drinks cold and also keeps them hot it's a double walled vacuum they also did it in a baby blue but this pink i just thought with the hoodie I'm literally going to feel like the bee's knees walking around like this. So it just says white fox on it. Again, in that bubble font. It does something to me, this bubble font. Uh, it's the little bubble font and then we have a little handle so we can carry it around and it even has a straw. I'm literally obsessed with this. I love me some ice cold water. So the fact this is going to keep my drink cold, but we also have a straw on it and then we can fold the straw down and chuck it in my bag and not have to worry about it spilling. It's literally taking every single box. Am I going on about a water bottle? Yes, I am, but I just think it's incredible. And the colour, she is stunning and she's like smooth. Like the material of this, I want to rub it on my face almost. It's just delightful. So we have her, very random, but like, needed that in my life there was no questions about whether i needed that or not i did then like i seem to have to do every single time i have to put my fingers in every single pie like chicken pie cherry pie apple pie and i have to get something from every single section of white fox like hoodies accessories swimwear and activewear i literally just cannot cope like i just have to get something from everywhere i'm like goldilocks i want to try it all out and i love white fox's activewear it just does something to the body that nothing else does before does that make sense like i got sports bras from there last time and they literally give me the boob job that i never knew i needed but oh my god my boobs have never looked better so i decided rightfully so that i needed to get some more stuff from the activewear so this time i got this jumpsuit because there was loads of pictures of it on like different people on the website and i just it looked amazing on everyone so i was completely sold and it's the mission mission accomplished jumpsuit i got it in an extra small so this is what it looks like on the front you'll be able to see this on a little bit easier on in the trial clips but i just love the shape of it this feels so slinky and stretchy as well the material she's chef's kiss and then the back has like i don't think you're gonna be able to see it because it's like um black on black but it's got like a cutout detail on the back and then it has got like a built-in sports bra with would you call that pad it? Pad, 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 bleh. padding? I think that's padding. You can either um, keep in or take out. Would you call it padding or lining? I don't know what the word is, but you know, that stuff you get in sports bras, you can take it out. And I just love this. Like you could wear this for working out, but you could also wear it for like that athleisure vibe. I think like a slick back bun, new balance, little socks, and this is going to look absolutely incredible. I cannot wait to wear this and style this. Again, I think this is going to take part in my Lizzie McGuire outfit repeater kind of section because this is going to be something I literally live in. And then, I mean, it's been about 
about two minutes since I mentioned a jumper, so I feel like it's only rightfully so that we go back to jumpers. I got another little tracksuit. I just couldn't help myself, okay? And when you see this, I mean, you've kind of seen it now. You're gonna understand why. This one's different though, because it's a crew neck jumper, okay? It's not a hoodie and it's not quarter zip, so it's something different. Um, This is her. She is bright, she is everything. I'm just loving this like mild gray with the pop of color on, because it means like neutral girlies like me can wear it, but still feel within our comfort zone, but we're still giving a pop of color. I'm just, I just love it. So this is the Archive 6.0 oversized sweater. I got it in a small slash medium. Look at this color. I don't even know what this color is. Like, is it orange? Is it pink? Is it coral? I don't know, but I'm here for it, whatever it is. It's like neon, it's bright, it's like, wow, it's in your face. I love it. And then of course, guess what I did? Guess what I did? Give you two seconds. I got the matching shorts to go with it. And these ones I really love because they've got like a nice white drawstring on them, which I just feel like adds a little bit of va va voom voom in the words of Lady Gaga. I think that's a Lady Gaga song. And then on the back, it's just got one pocket, not two, just one on the left bum cheek. And I quite like that. I like the asymmetricness. I like the, the difference to other shorts. I just love it. And then we have got the matching logo on the bottom here to tie in so nicely with this. I literally love this. Like I feel like for the summer, this is going to look incredible. Like with a tan for all you Australian girlies, this is going to be perfect for you. But even as a Brit in the middle of the greyest, dreariest winter I think I've ever seen in my entire life, this is going to give me that pop of colour that I need in my life because honestly someone has forgotten to turn the sun on today like it is so grey but this is just going to be the light to my life that I need at this time of year and I literally cannot wait to wear it. What should we go for next? Should we, should we go for another jumper? Should we or should we not? Go on then, why not? You're going to love this so, so you're not going to want to wait any longer. Um, is she grey mile again? Yes she is. Didn't realise I'd done that. Apparently I just love the grey Marlon white box. And clearly I love their jumpers as well. They are literally my favourite. Look at this one, okay? This one I got in a small slash medium. She's quite subtle on the front. It says white fox in red and then underneath it in white it says love club. And then it's again business in the front. Boom, party in the back. Look at that, I'm obsessed with it. Big red love heart, white fox love club since 13. I absolutely love this. Valentine's Day is gonna look amazing. Christmas this is gonna look amazing because it's like red and white but it's not like a horrible Christmas jumper that's really tacky and you don't really like. This is like, I can wear this all year round but it also kind of works for Christmas. And also red is so popular at the moment. Like everyone seems to be wearing red and I've not jumped on that hype. And then I saw this and I thought, I'm gonna get that. Then I can jump on the red hype. But it's still, again, it's on the gray mile. So she's still in my comfort zone, but giving me that little pop of red. It's just the best of both worlds. Look at how nice this is. I'm literally obsessed. I love that giant like love heart on the back. It's potentially the cutest thing I've ever seen. Now that is this box done, but there's still more to come. Do not panic. Let me just move her out of the way. And now we just have the rest of this absolute giant box, which you may be glad to know is not now going to be loads of tracksuits we have a variety of other things to show you we'll go with this next so i feel like it's rude that i've not shown a t-shirt yet i got this one because i absolutely loved the font on this so this is what it looks like it's white with this navy blue on which says white fox season seven they had so many nice bits from this collection i literally could have got so much like picking these things it was so difficult i feel like this was potentially harder than my gcse's my a levels like narrowing it down is impossible but i just love this font and i got this in a large slash extra large what large slash extra large so i can wear it like as a kind of t-shirt dress it's really nice and oversized and then i actually saw someone like this man was like wearing man that sounds weird calling someone a man even though them like that's what he was on the website this man was wearing this t-shirt with this jumper and I was just sold. I never would have thought to put them together, even though they're from the same collection, I just wouldn't have thought to wear them together, but I just loved how it looked on him. So then I got this, which is from the same range, and it's a zip up hoodie and I'm not really a zip up hoodie person but then I saw this picture of him and it was an absolute game changer so this I got in a small slash medium it's the season seven zip front hoodie in deep sea um so it's like navy with a kind of like light blue font on and then he had this like unzipped with matching joggers on and then this t-shirt underneath and because this has got navy on the t-shirt I mean that's really not showing it very well but trust me it was absolute chef's kiss I was obsessed with it so I basically saw that out for idea um and I got the hoodie and the top to wear together and I will probably live in that for the foreseeable future although I've said that about three things now and how am I going to live in all of them at the same time I don't know maybe I just do like a rotation like Monday can be the pink set Tuesday can be the love heart jumper Wednesday can be this and so on and so forth um okay right I actually promise you that is the last jumper like I, I actually swear on my life the rest of the stuff in this box is not jumpers we'll move completely away from jumpers um to a complete different category we're gonna go back to accessories because I got this little hat and I'm obsessed with it it's like a beige hat with white writing on that says white fox and then it's kind of got this like distressed vibe to it so it's got like 
little rip there, little like rips alongside it. But it's nothing like too major. It's not giving my dog style my hat and ripped up, which my dog actually did do once. I used to work somewhere where I had to wear a hat, which was literally the bane of my life. Like it was the ugliest hat ever. It was like base, not even baseball. It was like snap back vibes, okay? It was the most hideous uniform ever. And then Reggie, when he was a puppy, stole that hat out my work bag and ripped it, which meant I couldn't wear it anymore. And it was literally like a blessing because I hated that hat and I had a genuine reason to not wear it anymore. Anyway, this hat doesn't give those vibes. It's such a nice shape. And it also, it doesn't look like a dog's eating it. It's like the cool level of distress. Does that make sense? What a weird way to explain that. Um, but yeah, that is the hat. I'm really trying to get into my cap girl era. Just feel like it looks so cool. And especially like greasy hair, just tuck it on, add something to an outfit and I just loved the colour of this like the beige we all know I'm a sucker for beige so it's very very me and then I got this little pyjama set but am I planning on wearing this out of the house yes of course I am but it's just such a cute little two piece that like I would wear this to bed but I would also happily wear it out of the house this I got in an extra small it's their daydreaming pyjama set which is the softest material which I think is so important for pyjamas like if there's one thing that pyjamas should be it should be soft like no one wants like uncomfortable pyjamas and these are literally like stretchy soft absolutely love these so this is what the top looks like i'm literally just gonna wear this as a top with so many things because it's just like a little white ribbed one with these little buttons down the front and i just thought that was adorable and then these are the trousers to go with it so again they're ribbed white and then they kind of like are a wide leg flare sort of uh, trouser with an elastic kid waistband what a cute little two-piece and i just thought this would look so cute like a big fluffy coat and uggs for like a little sunday farm shop visit or something like that and then you can just come home take the jacket off and then you're in your pajamas already it's a win-win like who doesn't want to be able to wear their pajamas out of the house but not noticeably look like they're wearing pajamas like when i was shopping in aldi the other day this woman blatantly clearly came in in her dressing gown and pajamas and she looked comfy and she looked amazing but like this means i can kind of not look like i'm wearing pajamas but i am actually wearing my pajamas and then i don't have to get changed when i get home does that make sense like literally hannah montana would love this it's the best of both worlds so we have her and then i had to get this dress because it's the nicest thing ever is it bitterly cold in england right now yes it is but i thought for like evenings you know like christmas dinners little like new year's eve drinks this would look really really cute and you could wear it for that and i'm basically just going to make it work until that sunshine comes back out because i just was so obsessed with it and it is this black dress it's a lovely kind of like cotton feeling material this i got in an extra small it's the trending now mini dress and it looks like this. It's got this really lovely square neckline, which I love, these thick straps, and then it just kind of goes out a little bit. Super gorgeous. This is gonna work with so much. She's gonna be versatile. Put her on with some sparkly heels or some black heels, New Year's Eve sorted. But then at the same time, you could wear this in the summer with some cute little sandals and it's a cute little summer dress. So like, we're talking winter to summer, day to night. I feel like there should be another thing that I can say in there. I don't know, but like so many occasions, this is gonna work so well with absolutely stunning. They also did it in a white, but there was something about this black that I absolutely love. Like how stunning is that? Like she's simple, but she's effective and I love her. And then I may or may not, have got another thing from the pajama section, which again, I have intentions of wearing out of the house, but I just thought this was so cute. This I got in an extra small. Did I say for reference my sizes at the start? I don't think I did. For reference, I'm five for five and I'm a size six. This is their Keep Calm pajama romper. How flipping cute. The lace detail in the bow, are you kidding me? I just thought this was adorable. Again, I will be wearing this to bed. Again, I also will be wearing this at the house. I just thought like with a nice big denim jacket on in the summertime, this would look so cute. It's kind of like a like a square sort of like, um, what is that word? Like, I don't know. I have a dressing gown like this and it's got like this squares on and I don't know what it's called, like toweling maybe, but it's not toweling. I don't know, but I just thought it was really cute and I just loved the lace detail. It's got adjustable straps, which is perfect. So you can make it fit really well. Go slightly lower down on the back than it does at the front. And I just thought it was so cute that I couldn't resist. And then I did another, the thing that i've already mentioned where i had to get a summer piece just because i couldn't resist and i had to pick myself up a bikini because i feel like it's a criminal offense to not get a bikini from white fox when you're shopping on there because their swimwear again like their gym wear there's something magical in it and it really does things for the body and for the boobs that no other swimwear i've ever tried on before does so i just had to get another piece to add to my collection because honestly my white fox bikinis that i already own are my go-to's they're my favorite swimwear literally the best swimwear i've ever tried like hand on heart 
Girl Guide Scouts Honor. White Fox Swimwear is my absolute favorite. So I was so tempted to get so many pieces and then I had to remind myself that I live in England and it's cold and we're in winter. So I only ended up getting one. And I went with this one because it just, it's called the Always Poolside Bikini, which is what I aspire. And it's in the shade Blueberry, Blue, why can't I say this? Blueberry Floral, which also sold it to me. And I just loved it so much. So this is the top. It's got little white bows on the straps. How flipping cute. And then it's got these little like blue flowers on. Um, it's just like a classic triangle one. And then these are the bottoms, which also have a little bow in the middle. How flipping cute is this? And honestly, these bikinis do things to my boobs that, like I said, no other bikinis have done before. They are the most flattering bikinis. They wash so well. They cope really well in chlorine. I've had some for a few years and they are literally as good as they were when I first got them. And I love them so much. And I just couldn't not get a bikini, even though we are in December. Watch me go swimming in the sea on New Year's Day in my New Year's swim in this because I just cannot wait to wear this. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is everything that I got from White Fox. Thank you so much to White Fox for sponsoring this video and for sending all these bits over. Thank you all so much for watching. Like I said, I've got a 15% off discount code for you all, which I'll leave on screen here again. And I'll also leave it down below along with links to everything. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe down below. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments and I'll reply to you. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you at some point soon in another video. Bye.